Republicans block him at every turn. They wouldn't work with him at all. Really. The Republicans tell me, and I watched it, how all of those Republicans up there bowed down to his every wish. How'd we get Obamacare and a bunch of this other nonsense? How did he get by with all his executive orders? How did he get by with a bunch of nonsense? Yet yeah, you want to blame anybody but Obama. Got you. How many do you think you go buy into that? Republicans 
are of a like mind. You can't tell them apart. The differences in the two of them are so minute. That's how Trump got in. So guess what? It won't only be the Democrats that's going to try to block him. They're going to recruit some of the rhinos. Republican in name only. That's your rhino. And they're going to, the Democrats are going to be recruiting some of them. You think there ain't something to recruit? Yeah, they are. They're there. They're always there. Old John McCain from uh, Arizona, I think. What do you think he is? That's why he didn't get the support he needed when they tried to force him upon us in that last election. Uh, all of this stuff that y'all are whining about and Obama not getting his chance and all that, it's a crock of bull. All you're doing is making excuses for the worst Speed limit reduced ahead in our country's history. And he is. I uh, muted that, so we won't hear it again. That's going to be his claim. Jimmy Carter right now is a happy man. But Jimmy Carter was known as our worst president. Well, that title's been taken away. And with a little bit of luck, most of what Obama has done to hurt our country is going to get erased. All of it came, but oh, I sure hope bunches of it do. Uh, I tell you what.
and then trying to predict what he's going to do as a crock of bull. And yes, I know, it happens to all of them. This is not nothing new. Well, gee, who's surprised now? I'm not. to stop and uh, think with a clear head, people. What happened to the uh, other people when they got elected in and all this stuff? The only thing that's new to any part of this election is the simple fact that Trump is not just telling the media everything that he's doing. And that's eating them up. That leaves them having to guess. I mean, they even got mad because he went out to dinner and didn't tell them. He had told them that he was going in for the night, and then he decided to go out to dinner. Shame on him. Really? Trump ain't gonna play it like y'all are used to. And no, I'm still not a Trump supporter. I like him better than Hillary. I place a lot of hope in him because I don't have any other choice. He is what we have. So, I have to uh, deal with him. Just like this traffic, I just have to deal with it. There's some things you can't change. So you deal with it. for the new year to make a resolution to, to just support our country and the elected ones and, and let's all work together and, and, and see if we can't fix some stuff. But you know what? Then I sound like one of them elected officials that do that nonsense and they really don't mean it. And it wouldn't happen anyway. So, what the heck. And I ain't even gonna bother wasting my breath. I will ask you that if you're praying people to pray for our nation, that would be nice. But it's definitely gonna need it. Okay, big truck, now you're gonna move. Oh. Coming through Armadillo construction. Saturday, early Saturday afternoon driving. It is what it is. I guess everybody's on the way to the liquor store. Come on, wherever it takes me. Alright, folks. That's it for this video. Here in a little while, I'll see if I'm posting it. Well, God loves you. So do I. But, uh, Let's see what we can do to help our country. Let's try and pull it together in this coming year. Year right. God bless you.